I'm mad. A, tra- a, a talent agent is sitting in his office. This one goes out to all the Southern Fried Chicken lovers. Junior Special, one pack fifty. Junior Special, Junior Special, Junior Special, Junior Special, Junior Special, dude. You don't do. Junior Special, dude. Yeah. yeah. Uh. It's Junior Special. Yes, yeah, it's Junior Special. Junior. Dear Deviantar, today is the fifth day in a row, mother will not look at me. I've cut myself numerous times, but the bitch refuses to look. Neil, this is an urgent communication from Morpheus. Do you remember when I told you to take the red or the blue pill? You shouldn't have mixed them together, Neil. I'm sorry, but now you're stuck as a life-size ham beast. My regrets, love, Morpheus. By the way, Trinity says hi. I like to consider this the Oscar clip of this video when you see the despair in the character's eyes at the realization they'll never play the new Milana and Katana in the upcoming Mortal Kombat movie. Now yes, in hindsight, maybe they should have realized that both weighing 400 metric tons was going to disqualify them and perhaps they should have invested a little bit more in uh, their costumes and just a shitty little bandana wrapped around their face. But John Tobias and Ed Boon both had to think of the uh, franchise. It'd be unfair. You just can't have fat lady ninjas dropping out of the sky on Raiden. That's just, uh, that's just not fair. Oh, my pussy itches. Vagiso- Oh, but never mind, that was my phone. Hmm, okay. That's strange. Why is McDonald's on there three times? McDonald's, McDonald's, McDonald's. Hmm, that's a little- Oh, there we go, I've got a, a caller on a DS. Ah, yes, another integral part of the story. It really, really helps flush it out, and I'm glad they left it in. Now, they could have cut this out and made the video entertaining, but I like it. I like the dead air. We need lots and lots of dead air with nothing happening. Good decision. Hello? Oh, my God, you raging fucking whore! I'm on my DS, bitch! Do you want to go do something? No? The end. Ha, huh, no, nah, I wish, I wish. I'm just, uh, I'm fucking with you. Let's go back to the, uh, video. I'm on IRC. I can't be bothered. IRC is in everything, you know. What do you mean IRC isn't important? Oh, my bad. Let me reiterate that point for you. IRC isn't important for a few reasons. One, you're a faggot. Two, you're a faggot. And three, this is the important one now. You're a faggot. It's EDS1. I haven't changed. Do you know what IRC's done for me? IRC allows me to talk to people like Weave and Girl Vinyl and the rest of the- Name drop, name drop, name drop. I'm singing in the names. What a wonderful feeling. I'm name fagging again. And then I'm not going to be here to protect you. Um, hello. Huge internet celebrity here. EDS1. Ever heard of me? Uh-oh. I smell a plot point coming up. Can they craft this into some interesting thing? Let's find out. It's been three minutes of fucking nothing. Maybe they'll pull it off in the end. I'm EDS1. I'm a voice of a generation. I am the best parodies of all time. Of all time. And I also love Twinkies. <laughs> that right there is the only laugh this video is ever going to get. There you go, a dollar fifty exactly. Now please beat me in the back of the head with a blunt instrument so I never make an internet video again. Will that cover it? <laughs> Honey, I'm gonna be honest with you. I'd beat you in the back of the head with a hammer for free, but the dollar fifty does help. Hello, hello, ladies, thanks for having me today. Awesome! I've heard this song before. It's just like the forty that came before it. Edie Singers, you're amazing. No matter what the beat, or the tempo, or the background music is, you make every single one of your songs sound exactly the same. Thank you. I hate variety. Now, I don't want to come off as cruel. I'm not saying women can't be funny. Women can be hysterical when they have tight vaginas and can cook. Sadly, looking at these two, I don't think they can cook. Judging by their girth, they know how to go through a McDonald's drive through and as for having tight vaginas, I'm not sure if the gravitational pull of your ham hock sized thighs crushing a penis really counts as tight. So, yeah.
What a happy day this is. I'm so glad that Encyclopedia Dramatica got over its whole having standards thing. Because now these girls are representatives. They're users. They're envoys of ED. And when we all think of Encyclopedia Dramatica and all the interesting e-drama that surrounds it, remember these people. Because they are the new user base. This is the face of Encyclopedia Dramatica now. And for all you furries and fucked up people on the internet, all you cutters and emos and DeviantArt tartlets, there is hope. I mean, if these fat-ass weeaboos can become part of Ed, ha, anybody can. It's only a matter of time before Chris Chan's a fucking sysop. You know what this actually reminds me of? Uh, you know those autistic summer camps where they send troubled kids to learn socializing and how to interact and they participate in group activities? This seems like a video that would have been made by a group of kids in an autistic summer camp. It's about that funny and about that interesting. So, uh, gold star, Timmy? Good job, I guess? Can't get myself mad. Can't get myself mad. I get the feeling those lyrics are probably the most true-to-life ones that these girls have ever sung in their entire lives. Hit a little too close to home on that one, didn't ya? My god, is this video still going? I mean, I, I kind of dozed off at the beginning, and when the song started, it's like hypnosis. You know, it's the same fucking song from these people over and over and over and over again. So I just, I blanked out for a minute. I didn't realize it's a fucking seven-minute extravaganza that I have to sit through. Now, this part of the video is for all those people out there who thought all those fat jokes I made weren't fair. They are cooking cupcakes in the middle of their music video about tentacle monsters. What other person, aside from a huge fat ass, would do that? What a perfect capstone to this music video. A bunch of white people dancing horribly. Yeah, I think that pretty much goes with the theme of this music video. Fucking horrible. And this is why we should pass a law that anybody in junior high school can't have access to a computer or the internet. Because if they didn't, we'd never ever have to watch god-awful shitty music videos like this made by overweight weeaboos who can't sing. The aristocrats!